I'm gonna start the recording here. Hello, YouTube. Welcome in. We're finally, finally playing the Dark Pictures Anthology today. Picked it up. Uh, it was on sale on PlayStation, the entire set. All four of them. All four games for 60 bucks. We're gonna give them a go. I've been, I've been wanted to do this for a while. I, I have, I wanted to skip Man of Medan simply because I did see a playthrough of it and it's not g good. <laughs> it's, it's not, it's not good. Uh, it was not great what I saw. Most people do not enjoy this one, but I figured we'd give it a go anyway, because one, I paid for it. And two, it's got the, um, it's like the director's cut. So maybe there's some, uh, maybe they fixed it. Maybe they made it not so bad. I don't know. We'll find out. We'll see. We'll see what happens. But anyway, let's go. Hopefully audio and everything like works okay because all of my stuff was imploding earlier. <laughs> Bandai Namco. Oh! Oh, it's scary! Immediately. I've turned it down. Let me know if that's too low. Turn it back up a little bit. Man of Medan. Oh, dude. Take my whole life. I don't need it. I'm not using it right now. Is it going to analyze my data? Bruh. Rude, actually. Don't play alone. Play alone. Collections. The anthology. View other games. Settings. Special features. What are we getting settings? quiet i'll see but yeah there's co-op in this so uh one thing that they do like to do is that you can do uh like pass the controller mode for these um and each person can take control of their own character if they want which is pretty neat uh let's see let's make sure the subtitles are on yep Sidebars are fine. Audio preset. Yeah, that's all good shit. Yes. Graphics. Dude, give me all of the graphics. Are you sure you want to save the current setting? Yeah. Accessibility. Ooh. Okay, I'll leave all these off for now. And then if I need to change it, I will. Okay. Oh, I think it is running at like 30 frames per second on quality. Gross. All right, hold on. Hold, please. I'm changing it to performance. Oops. There we go. Oh, that's much better. Immediately. It even, like, actually kind of looks better. Oh. Pick one now. Don't debate us like with dead. I know, right? No. I, we're going with performance. That's what we're sticking with. Also, it wasn't my fault during Dead Space. What do you mean? All right, let's go. New story, please. It wasn't my fault. The game was actually broken. Skills will be tested. Forgiving. Survival is expected. Lethal. Death is inevitable. Well, I kind of want to kill all of them, so... Maybe we go with, uh... <laughs> with lethal. I don't know. I might play it on easy, just for funsies. We'll play it on medium. Why not? That was the one that it selected for me, so... Men of Madon. This game actually looks good. It's 
sir. You're very sweaty. General alarm. Is there a lieutenant speaker or Captain Siren, perhaps? There's just men in this game? Are they from Medan? That's an awful big room for four coffins. Joe, Dockside Market, Manchuria. Like the candidate? Alrighty, Buster. We better mosey on back to the ship. Whoa. Stop the presses. What? Looks like old Charlie Charming's got a little business to attend to. Oh no, I immediately hate him. Can I fight? Hey, give me a quarter. Why? They probably don't you take find a... out my future. Probably doesn't take American money. Let's have it. I already hate What's this game. We got a question to ask the tiles. Ooh. Curious. Tell me about my son. Or dubious, will I be rich? Oh, dude. I don't I don't give a shit about that. Give me money. Oh, it's the right stick? Ugh. Alright. So uh Oh, you have to hold it on it. Okay, I see. When am I gonna hit the jackpot? You know, uh all that glitz and glamour. Dude, when's my money coming? When am I winning the lottery? Dragon tile or bamboo? Uh, uh, dr dr dragons are cool. They're pretty neat. Tell me what you see. And see somebody who needs a pedicure. Hold R2 to pick up objects and then examine them. Alright. Oh, fish! Looks that, like a fish? That's a salmon. Don't fuck this decision up. Oh, I probably already did, I'm sure. Death and doom are sure to follow. Me at twitch.tv slash left for donut. What does that mean? Hey, what does that mean? What the hell, man? What are you mad about? You asked for your fortune. Hey, bud, let me get a go at it. Oh, yeah? Think you got the stuff? God, the faces and sure. the early, let me another quarter. early supermassive have... games are so creepy. Like, they're not great. <laughs> I'll give it a whirl. Dude, this fighting robot's like a Pokemon. Look at him. Blap. Blap. She is very unimpressed by my punches. Didn't even get time to read that. All right. I'm gonna fuck this up so bad. Oh no. Oh, it's so fast. Uh oh. She's not impressed, dude. I think I'm doing great. I don't know about you. Am I supposed to just keep going with this until I get hit or something? Oh, there we go. Got it. Dude, I'm a master. Let's go. Looks like I'm the karate master now. Wouldn't you know? I hate this man. Why am I wasting my time on this idiot? Lamea. We don't want to get stranded. Come on, man. Just let me ask another question. We really need to get back. Why does everybody sound like they're talking through a sock? Is that just me? 
Oh, and how the how is the audio, by the way? Is it too loud? Do I need to turn it down a bit? I'll turn it down like a pinch. Let me know if that's too much. I just deal with a bunch of idiots who think they can beat up this m mechanical machine and get the shit knocked out of them, dude. T t oh, t I'm sorry. All right, I'll turn it back. Jeez. <gasps> Hi, Starling. Hello. How are you? Welcome in. Hope you're doing all right. Where's my change, bro? Oh, you get in more subs? Dude. Calm down. Calm down, dude. Oh, that guy got knocked out. <laughs> Was he the man? Of Madame? Thank you, Oz. What is happening? <laughs> Good thing she's doing the uh, should be sleeping but absolutely refuse thing. Oh, dude, I do that all the time. Like, <laughs> I, I, like, uh, what did Key call it once? It was like revenge stay awake because I don't want to go to work the next day. They came back late, so they're getting punished. Gotcha. Ooh. Oh! Yo, give me zombies, dude. Oh, those boys got fried. Active sabotaging future me, but it feels good right now. I know that feel all too much. <laughs> You're gonna regret it the next day, but you stayed up and got like 20 extra minutes on YouTube, so. Hashtag worth. That's why I end up like passing out when I get home from work. This is why you don't drink, kids. Don't do it. You're so sweaty. Explore the ship, find a way out of the sick bay. Ooh, 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 sluggish, uh-oh. Oh, if that's what the icons are gonna look like, I'm not gonna be able to see any of them. Two pops, come back soon. Looks like my handwriting. As an adult. Too late, I drank earlier. Aw, oh, dude. You're gonna end up on the ghost ship, man. You can't do that. That's what happens. You drink, you end up on the ghost ship. Oh, everything's... Oh! What the hell? So he's fine, right? Oh, dude, he's got money. Get it. Quick. Before somebody walks in. Hurry. Why, though? Yep. Yep, that sure is a key. That that definitely is one. I... Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought I would have to press X or something. Dude, free cash. Let's go. Can I have his pin? Uh, I cannot interact with the dead man. All right. Rest in pepperoni. Ooh, the walking is kind of gross. Not going to lie. Hey, buddy. Just staring at me, you know, for fun. Yeah, dude. It's my favorite pastime. 
He had a pin in his pocket. I wanted it. I wanted it. You can always use a pin. Let's go this way. Why not? This looks like a direction. Sure. Hello? Legit, though, this game actually looks really good. Howdy, Charlie. Is this a quiet time off? Hold on. Just get me out of here already. What the hell's just, going on up there? You know, just going along aircraft. like we didn't and just see a dead man in a locker. And there was a... Uh... Oh, okay. Never mind. He mentioned it. Good. Bay. Something's wrong. Let's get out of here. Find a pin. Pick it up. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you, madam. Hey, man. <laughs> Already. Already. Well, let's hold on. Let's go back this way. See if there's anything over here. Which are probably yeah, it's made by the same people, Bert. These uh, so this whole anthology thing is the games that they made in between Until Dawn and the Quarry. So. Audio is all over the place. We'll keep it there. Having fun so far? Uh, well, we just started, so. Interact with the heartbeat. Uh oh. Okay. Boom, boom. What happens if I fuck it up? Is he gonna turn around and shoot us? I hope it doesn't implement motion controls because I would actually be very sad. All right, we're good. We're good. Those other people are not so good. Mato, how are you, by the way? You doing all right? What the hell? I don't know, dude. What was that? Ah, uh, children. The scariest of all. Damn it. Okay, well, I can open that. But what's down here, though? Another door. Cool. Oh, fuck it, I'm going in this one. Okay, maybe not. Hey, Charlie, help. Hail. Charlie, you probably ought to close your mouth before a bird like nests in there or something. Oh! Fuck no. Yeah, you said it. Foobar and this. Watching my shorts, very fun. Aw, oh, thanks, man. I'm glad people are enjoying them. I've been having fun making them. Oh, can I not? Oh, well, hope there wasn't anything in that other door I needed. God damn. Another stiff? Who's the lucky winner? Oh, damn it. Fuck Ooh. Me. Last time I saw him in the mess hall, he was fit as a fiddle. Poor fucker. Dude, this guy got like ringued. Funny, you know, cyclist burned up on reentry. <laughs> yep, you got it. You got what Fubar is. Nicely done. <laughs> Why does everyone sound like they're talking? Uh, dude, right? I, I'm glad it's not just me. Everybody sounds like they're talking uh, either into a pillow or like through a sock. Like they have a sock over their face. What happened? <laughs> what? 
Old L1 to walk faster. Oh, okay. Why do I need to walk faster? Oh, not going that way. Alright. Need a Reno, neighbor Reno. Start down the hallway like it's a runway, dude. Hold three what? I only got two hands, man. Because you're making your way downtown. Walking fast. See as a ghost. Walking faster. <laughs> oh! Sees the children walking the other way. You see that kid over there? Uh, no. You feeling all right? We've got jump scared by a child twice now. Oh, this man's in a position. Uh oh. Charlie, get over here. There's bodies for the taking. They're free. Oh, don't tell me there's like actually shooting in this game. Uh oh. The controls are not great. <laughs> I'm not excited. I th Why does this man look like he's about to nut? Hello? Be taking a helmet. Yeah, maybe he's like some combat boots and stuff. They had me aim at shit? Well, look, man. That was for punches. Yo, this place is stinky. Come here. Hey, come here. Come on over here. Oh, God, no. Charlie! Choo choo, Charlie? Ooh. Oh, ghost child. How'd he die so fast? Uh, no, I'm not shooting that. What do you mean? Oh, maybe I should have shot it. Oh! Did it stab him in the boob? No, his titties! Did I lose immediately? No. <laughs> oh. All right, Meadow. <laughs> Mayday! Mayday! Is anyone there? Hello! Can anyone out there hear me? I feel like even if I did shoot in that, that still would have happened. It's a ghost child. Oh, it's the thing from uh, Outlast 2. Let's go. It's got a lot of arms and a lot of tongue. And that's not going to help you, bud. Whoops. such open mouths. <laughs> They're assuming the position. Am I gonna get copyright struck for this really sick song? Here he comes. Yeah, there he is. It's Captain Bowler Hat.
there was issues with it, eh, it'd be alright. I ain't worried about it. Well, what is this? I like how they managed to upgrade everything in the game, but the uh, cutscene here is still like 700p. Is he got duct tape on his hat? I respect it. Have a WWE entrance. <laughs> and in the left corner, the collector. Yeah, dude, it's because it's cool. This man's rad. Did he have to whip out a compass just to find his way to his office? Is your museum that big? All right, my dude, I get it. You probably could make this guy in the W. Oh yeah, absolutely. Especially the most recent one. Hello. Hi. And welcome to my repository. He's British. So we know, since he's in me media, we know he's instantly evil. I am the curator, the curator of stories, stories of love and hate, greed and beauty, life and Can death. you translate stories for such us? As this one. I'm here to record the story you choose to tell. You see, this tale is only part written, and the choices you make will complete it and determine whether the lives of those with whom you are interfering continue to flourish or whether they are snuffed out uh, excuse me i paid for this game you see we uh, why should i be the one that has to finish to our it own moral compass and we have to live with those decisions or die by them but you shouldn't fear death it is after all inevitable it is the tax one pays for having lived and it comes eventually i'm a classically trained everybody. shakespearean actor and i sound Still, amazing <laughs> none of us want for it to come too soon do we I don't know, man. I gotta go to work on Monday, so if we can make Actually it happen not, soon, the I, you take I don't think I'd complain. The choices you make will affect others. I'll be keeping a close eye on your progress. It's not my place to interfere, oh, don't watch but me. I might be persuaded to offer the occasional hint. No, it's performance Here's anxiety, dude. Free. There are pictures in this world that can show you some possible futures. Oh. If you can find them and study them, they may just help you to make better decisions. What are the chances I find none or should of them? I say decisions that result in the outcomes you would prefer. That's all for the moment. We'll talk again soon enough. We'll have the opportunity to account for all the actions that you've taken. Or whatever mess you've made. Bert, I was going to mention his eyes. He actually has like really nice eyes. Painting jump scare. Shit, dude. Brad. Oh, okay, cool. Can I immediately dump him in the ocean? Barefoot? Dude, you're gonna get splinters. Time to meet everyone we're killing. <laughs> Innocent and witty? Oh, okay. We get some character traits. All right. I listen to this and I keep feeling like I'm being told off by my headmaster. Alex, motivated. Brad's brother, Julia's boyfriend, insecure. Please don't tell me I'm supposed to remember all of this. Think we got enough? If we run out, we can always call for backup. So, uh, look. I've never been down there before. Down? The water? Diving? 
Well, maybe you could show me. I don't even know what water is. I've never experienced it. Serious? Uh, this is the closest I've ever been. Serious? Who came out here without taking any lessons? Kind of. Yeah. Oh, 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 okay. Insecure, it's embarrassing. Resentful, I had to work. Well, he's insecure, so. It's... It's what? It's embarrassing taking them by yourself. It's embarrassing you came all the way out here expecting me to hold your hand. <laughs> Whoa, careful. That dive cam is, like, super expensive. Look, bro, be cool. What? Julia and Don't Conrad break my are, shit! What do you mean, you know, be cool? How do I say it? Super fucking loaded? You gonna pay so? for that? So don't sweat the little stuff, man. It's not cool. What do you mean, little? Don't that thing was probably like a thousand dollars. There's a dick. Uh. The hell, dude. I don't know. This one. Uh, tag along? Seriously? I thought I was invited. Julia wanted you to come along. <laughs> For real? Julia? Yeah, man. She wanted you to come. And I wanted her to see how cool you are, which you're not. So be cool. Capiche? <laughs> Push him in the ocean. Right, Nobody would ever know. Calvary's almost just get rid of him. Sorry, I'm a little snappy. I'm just... The new medical school would be stressful, you know? Total shocker. And man, the long distance thing with Julia, it's been rough. I hate them already. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch, it's been two weeks. What do you mean? Yeah, I got you. It must be tough. No worries, man. Huh? <laughs> yep. Right on cue. What? Conrad doesn't think we have enough beer. Ah, I guess I keep these. Of course, the man named Conrad yeah. needs extra alcohol. Got it. Okay, so we have to keep this hey. man innocent. So, uh, can I get your input on something? No, yeah, you what? threw my tablet. It's Fuck a, you. Kind of a big thing I'm trying to make a decision about. About finishing med school? No, but it's just kind of a big life choice, you know? I don't know what's the right thing to do. Why so many feet shots? Do I don't know. I don't know. Sentimental cautious. Uh, sentimental sounds right for him. Gut. If it's right, you'll know. They know their audience. Hey. Oh, there he is! I don't care about you. Excited, reckless. Full hearty, relaxed. I forget this man's actual name, but he plays on a lot of stuff. Did Quentin Tarantino oh. direct Sorry. this? <laughs> Hi, this is Alex. Hey, what's up, man? Conrad. <laughs> Watch it, sis. Sean Astin. Yeah, right that's here. his name. Good to finally meet you, Conrad. This is Brad, by the way. My little bro. Hey. Bradley! <laughs> Hi, I'm like a nerd. I already know you. I've heard so much about you. She just punches titty? Yeah, uh, likewise. Hey, man. Want to crack a cold one with me? Every second. Uh, uh, that's a lot this man was in Animorphs. He sure was. Relaxed. Yeah, cool. Apprehensive. I get seasick. Um. Man, sure. Yeah. yeah. Cool. A little titty touch hey. as a treat. I, I love <laughs> Just a little poke right in the nipple. You know. To signify we're friends now. <laughs> Right on, Radical. I like the cut of your ship. It's Jib. Don't ruin it. Don't be a dork. Be cool. You ever do any diving before? Gloomy. Never. All the time. What? How am I supposed to know? I don't know this man. Say nothing. Hey. Be silent. Don't look so worried. It's gonna be fun. <laughs> <laughs> What's his traits? <laughs> Innocent and witty? Where's the okay. old crust bucket skipper anyhow? Impatient, courageous. I'd invite you to make yourselves at home, but uh I remember this woman. I don't like her. So is everybody on board and ready to go? Selling, I'm buying. What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> Get dunked on, idiot. It's gonna kick all our asses and we'll tell her thank you because of it. Absolutely.
Oh, buddy. All right, that's okay. Get it out. Better out than in. Get it all out. Uh, yeah. I wrote this game. You uh, want to go lie down? Yeah. You know, maybe I should. Yeah. Oh boy. Duke of Millen. What about over here? That's pretty far out of the way. I'm just thinking about backup targets in case we don't find anything on the dive cam. Listen, to be honest, I've never heard of this wreck you're looking for. Usually these things are crawling with divers. Yeah. This one's different. I'm just saying, if it gets too late, I know some nice places where you can just take, you know, a nice dive. We're not here for a nice dive, dude. We're here for treasure. Uh. I've immediately I forgot this man's it right shit. Here, it's here. Okay, look, you're the client. I'm just saying we don't have unlimited daylight. I'm gonna go help Conrad and Julia with the camera. What you got? Traits updated. Let's see. Okay. Insecure, eager, motivated, impatient. Okay. What does all this mean? Oh my god. Secrets? Oh, there's so many. 50 of them, actually. Brad told Alex to follow his gut. No. Oh. All right. Feast your eyes on this. Brad's calculations were right on the money. Always bet on Brad. Yeah, kid's a whiz. We should thank him. Bliss, we found a plane. Yeah? Yeah, looks like World War II. We are ready to dive. Uh, technically, we should call this in to port authorities as an unreported wreck. Yeah, yeah maybe we listen to her. Are you sure you don't want to do this the right way? Who cares? Can't dive. Uh... That one. Look, for all anyone that sounds knows, like him. We were just diving and then found it. Who cares? The right way. Come on, what is this, kindergarten? I had to bring it up. If we just go down and take a look, who's gonna know? Fine. As long as you're quick. And don't touch anything. Following the rules is for suckers, oh, dude. Can't wait to be the first Following the rules there. is for people who don't get treasure. Untouched? We should be ready to get you guys in the water in a few. I'll set up the tanks. The boys will do the final checks. Take a look at the camera. See if you can find anything useful. Righto. I doubt it since it's just a JPEG, hey, maybe but you, you know. Check on your bro? Maybe we can get something out of it. <laughs> Duke of Milan. They spelled the name of the game wrong. Can't even get it right in their own game. Hmm. Can't believe I paid money for this. Are we looking for pirates? Buoy. Don't scare me. Don't do it. Swear to God. I might actually poop. All right, now we're good. Should I check on my dude? Hey, hey. Hi, sweetie. Don't talk to me. Okay, Almost talk to me. You're good to go. Concerned, interested, need a hand. That one. Need an extra hand? Never used a rebreather before. I think we're in good shape. It's probably not a bad idea for you to have a clue how these things work. Gotta say, not too. Yeah, maybe teach me how the life-saving device actually operates. That might be neat. Seriously, where does she get off bitching about us? She's making a oh, small okay. fortune that was, on this trip. That was yeah, a lot more rude small. than I rules thought it was going to be. I get it. But what's the big deal if nobody finds out? Yeah, that's what I'm Waiting saying. for a child to sprint past right. the <laughs> Nox. <laughs> we'll Just go sprinting the across the ocean. Ooh. Just holler at us when you're ready. <sighs> Not happy with the captain who wants you to be safe and follow the rules. I know, right? Who would do such a thing? What a buzzkill. Take a look. What is this tablet? 
Why does it look like it's a, a window on a spaceship? Neat. That's a plane. Yep, we found one. Is there... Is something actually going to appear? Or? Massive case of... Uh, for water... But, well, yeah. Yeah, no. It's... Yep, those sure are pictures. Cool. Thanks, man. What do we got over here? Full name, Felsit Dubois. 10383. Uh, driver number, why is it like all fucked up? What? <laughs> why does it say D uh, Nubmer? Hello? Height five eight. Why is it? Oh, it's so strange. What do you mean? Hair's color brown. Eye colors, as in, okay. <laughs> the un instructory identified on the rear is authorized to conduct classes in the designate specialty, as sanctioned by Dive Master Fed Fed. Fed Federation. <laughs> Did she print this herself? Did she make this? Hello? This doesn't look kosher. <laughs> Did, she... Did she just use Google Translate? Uh, uh... Wow. All right. Hey, so I don't think she might be a real dive instructor. <laughs> Misspelled because it's fake? Probably. I think that's supposed to, like, they did it a little overboard. But, you know. 29C? Can I get that in real weather? Oh, I turned it off. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you, you need that? that? Uh, <laughs> no. Not really. My bad. You might want to just let it do its thing. Yeah, okay. No, that's fair. I shouldn't go poking your stuff. Whoops. Hey, bud. You down here puking? Tanks are ready when you are. Huh. What am I looking at here? Ooh. Uh. Okay, dude in the bathroom. Got it. Am I supposed to get anything else from that? What? Do I need to go watch that? Hold on. How's this shit work? Uh, pictures. Your premonition. Okay, he had a bracelet on. The floor is like next to a bathroom. What? How is that supposed to help me? What do you mean? Okay. Don't go in that room? Go in that room. I have no idea. It's like 85? Ah. What's up? How you doing? What up, bro? Sorry, that brewski got the better of me. <laughs> well, your first mistake was calling it a brewski. Uh, Stern. Jeez, man, you should know how to handle your liquor. Lay off. Just try the bond with Conrad, like you said. My guzzling brews? Come on. Okay, okay. You go hit the high seas. It's also beer. It's not It'll liquor. What good. do you mean? Who are these people? They're not. None of them are real. <laughs> not a single person on this boat that's a real human. Who knows if the picture is good or bad, right? Oh, oh, oh god, okay. I hope I don't ever have to run through multiple corridors. I'm not sure Julia left anything on the mainland. Shroud of Innocence. 
That's not what. Okay. The what if parfum? It's made her happy. All right. A must read for anyone with an interest in the Salem Witch Trials of 1692. A.P. Davis, The Herald. All right. I got a witch book. Neat. Some of us can't handle beer. But he called it liquor, though. Liquor, I hardly know her. Carbonated bread water. Yeah, it's all gross. Okay. Dude, this fan's got some cake. You seeing that? Oh, sorry. Hold on. Look, I'm listening to now how me had me shouting profanities in the car. Oh, oh no. I'm sorry. <laughs> Let's talk to her for a minute. Hi, are you a real you know, diver? We have rules out here for a reason. You guys gotta respect that. Uh, well, let's be nice. Uh, yeah, sorry about before. Everybody's just a little... We've been planning this whole thing for a while now. I get it. But there are rules and laws and customs. These rules are all pretty basic stuff. How much experience do you have with these kind of dives? Dived a couple of wrecks. Fake credentials. Oh, yeah. Should we confront her on that? Sure, why not? How experienced are you? <laughs> Excuse me? I mean, I know what your fake credentials say, but I don't know the truth. <laughs> Were you snooping around? You don't trust me? You left them, like, right out in the open. What do you mean? The fake certificate is only temporary. My old one expired, and renewal out here is like extortion, okay? This dive is supposed to bankroll the fees. But that's not exactly following the rules now, is it? So I guess that applies to all of us. For all you know, this could be a war grave. Disturbing it would be illegal and immoral. <laughs> I get it. How much? Don't antagonize the person. Driving the boat. Yeah, but this guy's kind of a dick, so. You see anyone else out here? Who's gonna know? We logged our route at the harbor. If someone sees it's been disturbed, it ain't gonna be hard to put two and two together. Especially if some little souvenirs show up online. <laughs> you know what? I can't stop you. Just respect the rules down there. Don't do anything I mean, stupid that'll get my ass in trouble. You absolutely could. You could just drive the boat away. You know? That is an actual option that you have. Just throwing that out there. <laughs> Just curious if anything else would show up on this now that I've talked to everybody. I don't think so. Oh, yeah, I'm not cycling through all of them. It's so slow. She okay. turned away and that so, bothers me. I know. I saw her like float over it a little bit and it was very strange. Setup. It takes all that CO2 that you'd normally just exhale into the water and instead it gets totally reused. Then it reduces decompression time on your way out. State of the art. It's like magic. Okay. O2 check done. Fliss is a ghost. Oh my god. Can't be. This oh, is the, my ghostless you run. You gotta check your O2 first. Don't make my title a liar. Good, Jay. I'd like to take you underwater. Hey, that's my sis you're talking about. You know it. Okay, you little clown fishes. I'm gonna go see what Fliss is up to. You behave, Connie. Uh, she was driving the boat. Just looking for a first mate. Did you just say looking for a first mate? Oh, uh, the uh, camera. You're on camera. I'll take the wheel. Let's get a before photo. Cheese. Right, kids, good to go. 
Just remember the rules, please. Uh, well, let's take this too. Why not? I need to talk to her. I got the bang stick. Yeah, I heard that about you. Ha ha. <laughs> you ever have to use one? On a shark? Nope. Is it literally just a, a stick that explodes? To scare off sharks? Wee! Whoa. You good? God, don't make me swim, please. Why? You don't bonk me, bonk the shark. What do you mean? Like we're going to ransack the plane. Hey, a souvenir would be cool. It's not like one tiny little thing would hurt anybody. I won't tell if you won't. <laughs> it's not like we can scan the wreck every night at sundown. There. That shape. That's gotta be it. It's Michael Myers. Oh, the shape. That is like way bigger than I thought. How do you get down here? It's pretty intact too. This is a fucking remarkable find. Let's swim around a little and find a way in. I'm getting Subnautica vibes and I'm scared. He took lessons Howdy, from Jason. You fancy a pint with your second in command? You are not my second in command, third in command. No. Fresh and eager cabin boy. <laughs> Still a no. Your well-paying, dashingly handsome, seafaring client is requesting the pleasure of your company over a frosty amber liquid. Uh, no, fuck off. Pass. I have to stay focused on your friends down there. Not taking a drink from strangers. Pretty nice ride you got here. Where'd you get the cash? It's a long story. Don't ask a lady about her money. It's a long story. It's complicated and it's really difficult to explain. Well, I'm a complicated guy. Try me. Well, it involves at you don't least look complicated to me. And you look like every other white man I've ever seen. With large numbers on them. So you took out a loan. You know, you're smarter than you look. If you're interested, maybe my family can make an investment in your business. Thank you, Bert. We're on the same page. <laughs> what do you say? I d missed it. I built this business from scratch. I took out a loan on my boat, and that's all the help I need. Thanks. My popcorn! It's done! Uh, you know what? I better spend some time keeping the Duke of Milan ship shape. Aye, aye. You, I hate him. Yeah, he's kind of gross. Wait for the others to return from the dive. Check on Brad. Oh, yeah, Brad's still, like, downstairs puking. Oh, this poor guy. Boop. Weather looks clear. Still 80 degrees in the afternoon. Neat. What if I just drove the boat away? You think that's an option? Hey, man. Uh, 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 uh. Man, I really hope the uh, survival of these characters is not dependent on moving. I hope those clowns don't get me in trouble. Same exact pictures. Okay, cool. Duke to Alex. Duke to Julia. Yep. We got some ghosts. All right, they know how to use the CB. Can we spot the ghost, though? Ghost pirates? Be pretty sick. No? No ghosts. All right. Is it me you're looking for? Spooky, are you ghost pirates? Blessed! Okay, all right. Ooh. <laughs> Guess can at least wait until the game gets scary. <laughs> How dare you? 
Hey there. How's it hanging? Uh, it doesn't. I don't have anything that hangs, so. Uh, let's be stern with him. You can monitor the dive while I do some boat maintenance. Not a problem, Bob. It's not my name. So are you beached? What does that mean? So are you beached? Like a whale? Hey, I just thought, why spend all my time down in the dark when I already like what I see up top? I have to keep track of the dive, but uh, yeah, no, not romantic. <laughs> nice one. How long you been cooking that one up? All afternoon. Good use of your time. I like to make the most of it. Mm-hmm. I'll see you later. Yeah, didn't do barf. My lore is I'm a ghost plague doctor, but maybe I'm out there on a boat. Oh, it could be. That'd be pretty neat, though. This man makes me cringe. Yeah, that's kind of his whole vibe, huh? Can she get the picture, too? No. Saita! I'm waving from the distance. <laughs> uh, no, we never went in here. Yeah, no, we, we did. Never mind. Does she care? Duh. Just to see that guy flirt badly. I know, dude. Why is everybody going through this poor person's stuff? <laughs> Rude. It's two people that have gone through this woman's bag. From the picking... Uh, d right? Dude, L.A. Noir was great. <laughs> and then you look back at it. You know, with its super advanced facial recognition technology they used for the characters and stuff. And it's like, it looks like they literally just projected the person's face onto a flat model, and it's gross. <laughs> How's it going? Knocked out by cold frosty. Man, I feel like such a wimp. Disapproving, go easy on the booze. Let's be nice to this hey, poor guy. It's your vacation. You're allowed to overdo it. I am officially starting a temperance club. Party of one. Lifetime membership. <sighs> Hope the lovebirds are having the time of their lives down there. Hope they know what they're doing. What do you know? What do you know about this wreck? Just rumors and theories. I got tired of the speculation and wanted to see if there was... Okay. Hey, Fliss. Why is their boat like halfway in the Look, water? There's a boat. It's not a very good boat. What's that about? It's not the Coast Guard fishing boat from the looks of it. Eh, d d uneasy. That is not the Coast Guard. So we're not under arrest. How should we handle this? Be quiet. Let me handle it. Feels off. Let's be confident. Uh, we are not doing anything. I'm the captain, so you be quiet and let me handle it. You got that? That boat is definitely sinking. Oh! oh now it's absolutely sinking. Guys, you gotta keep back. We've got divers in the water. Uh, oh, okay, bye. Back. Hey, we got damage here. You see this? Look at our boat. We can take care of this. The man. boat's all of problem. five frames. What I know. Think? Like uh, ten bucks cover it. Wow, this guy's just a wiener. Oh, isn't whoops, he? My bad. Let's make it twenty. God. Well, shoot. You you think it's more like thirty? I can do thirty. Please stop. It's not a good idea to let them know that you have money. I'm with you. Here, let's just throw in the whole pot. Oh, he's got the angry eye. He growled at him. <laughs> that man went raw XD at this man. Oh, jeez. Dude's like, this is why I'm yelling profanities in the car. Hey, chat, need a hand?
Conrad said one of the pictures showed an opening. Conrad, really? Really. There we go. The rear turret. Huh. Good on you, Cotton. The turret. We can get in through there. People who do this kind of stuff are just an entirely different level from me. You could not pay me to scuba dive into a wreck. I forgot there were oh, quick time events. Could be dangerous. Uh, ladies first. Oh, don't make me. Oh, don't. Don't do this. Okay, at least I don't have to do like Can up and down. Take a second to say could be annoyed shit, at skeletons Alex, that are totally still articulated after 70 years I in the water. It. Yep. It's a dream come true. <laughs> Let's not waste any time not exploring. Go, go, go. I'm exploring, dude. I think well, I'm trying to. My pet peeve. Yeah, there shouldn't be like <laughs> anything left whatsoever. Cartilage and all that, you know, tendons and things. The swimming's not bad. It's just like walking. Check it out. They reconfigured the bomb rack to hold lifeboats. Interesting. Uh-huh. Cool. Yep. One of the rescue boats is missing. Think they were using it? A secret. Let's see what else we can find. The man's got a selfie stick on there, but didn't isn't using it. Check it out. Oh yeah, let's use the boom stick, dude. Black. Hope we don't get attacked by sharks. He's got a gun. Ah oh, shit, dude, look out. Oh, should I do okay. Hey man. Everybody get down! Oh fuck! Okay, all right. <laughs> I think I went my wetsuit. Life gives you lemons. <laughs> Make a lemon party? What do you mean, Julia? Can we talk about this for a second? Pilot what? <laughs> and co-pilot. Gotta be. Plane crash. Get out of here. Waste of perish. Now. This stuff's been down here a long time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I want to drive the plane. Just start making airplane noises. Oh. Julia! Oh my god! Just don't touch anything else, please. Good god. Hello, sir. Peter? We found him? He's got barnacles? Wow. What the hell happened here? A little look at things. They knew they were goners. What? How would you know that? What? How's your mandible attached, buddy? <laughs> Sir, can you explain your togetherness, please? Supposed to leave? Hold on. Go back. Make sure I got everything. Because dude's kind of hanging out in here for a second. I feel like I missed something. They were just built different. They got the iron jaw. Uh, uh, 
Come on. Come on. There we go. All right. Big bullet. Bullet hole. All down the fuselage. It's almost like this plane was in a war. Brad's gonna flip when he sees this. Are we just gonna leave dude down there? Whatever, he's on his own. I mean, that's not my problem. You have it stuff though. It's pretty tight. What if you get stuck without your rebreather? Live a little, maybe it is kind of dangerous. Nah, dude, let's go. She's <laughs> reckless. I th fine. think that was her Go thing. Mad. Seriously? Am I dead? What's happening? Live a little, Edgelord. Did she call him a gonad? Bad things happen in this crashed war era aircraft. I know, right? Rut row! Oh no! The god of hentai! Ma'am, you might want to get going. Oh! Got it. Uh oh! I was gonna say, unless that thing like purged the water, she shouldn't be breathing yet. That's it. One chance. Get that. I know what I'm doing. I was fine. Oh no, dude, that was great. Yeah, no, everything is fantastic. We did it. Don't worry about it. Searching in progress. Searched area one clear. Area two clear. Area three clear. This says it was a rescue plane. Ooh. Launched from a U.S. base. Let me see. Air Rescue Service Flight Plan, Flight Type VFR, Search Mission, Aircraft Type B-29 Sea Air Rescue, Reconnaissance Plane, Aircraft Identification, ARS-01, B-7-4821, Text Obscured, Kowalski, Kowalski, excuse me, Takeoff U.S. Air Base, Island Destination, Text Obscured. Dude, my favorite... They were on their way to help out a ship. Favorite place to go. Text obscured. We gotta get out of here. Now! <gasps> oh no! Uh oh. Shark. I used the stick. Now there's a shark? Yeah, come at me, shark! Yeah, come on, dude! It's a gray weed shark. Let's punch it in the snoot. Let's go. Oh, it's Hold on. not uh, a problem, Shark. Oh, okay. Thought this was the right time, but then didn't know if it was the right time. <laughs> but there's no time. Will you right marry time. me underwater? I know. Yes. Oh, he um, actually is. <laughs> I know you can't tell because we're underwater, but I'm on my knees right now. Uh -huh. Oh, dude. Julia. A terrible time. Will you marry me. Oh, Star. Thank you so much for hanging out tonight. I appreciate you. Thanks for coming by. I hope you have a good night. Get some good sleep. Get uh, get some good rest. Glad I caught you enjoy the stream. Oh, I'm glad you had a good time. And thanks, uh, thanks again for hanging out. Have a good one. We'll see you later. Bye bye. Uh, we almost died. You're shitting me, right? You're shitting me, right? What? <laughs> like there's a hidden camera down here or something? Uh... <laughs> okay, come out guys, the gig is up! Julia, I'm serious. Any time to think about that? Whatever, they're in love. Alex, wow. What a goddamn story. How's it end? Yes! Yes, they'll marry the shit out of you! <laughs> <laughs>
And also the piss. All right, handsome hero. The shark oh, just comes out of nowhere and eats hero. her hand. Crumbling death trap. Flip, this is Julia. We're coming back up. Over. Hey, where's that other boat come from? Uh, probably some other part of the ocean. Wait, Julia, we gotta decompress here. Uh, uh oh. Damn. What the fuck? We gotta get up there. Wait, we have to decompress. No, decompress. That, yeah, yeah, like, okay. fucking decompress, right. air in your blood is not good. They'll be fine. Just a few more seconds. Okay, now. Go, go. See, it was just hey, the grill. What's going on? What the hell happened? It's cool, man. Everything's all right now. How do you blow up a grill? There was a little uh mishap with the barbecue. Jesus, looked like the whole boat was lit up. Why are you paying the ocean? What's up with the other boat? <laughs> so why are you why making are you it rain on the ocean, ocean, dude? A group of fishermen came by and damaged their boat. They got caught on the dive line. Oh, that's what happened. Yeah. So then uh, Ambassador Conrad figured the best move is to show him he'd rather throw away his money than give it to them. You're an asshole. <laughs> Whatever. You're an asshole. Care, right? What I want to know is... Just such a dick. Well, we found the plane, and it is huge. Full of cool stuff. Oh my god, you Yeah, guys, like dead you people. Shut up for like one second. Holy shit. Dude, bro, congrats. Nicely done. Come up and let's celebrate. I hate all of these people. <laughs> Are you disappointed in your curator, Daddy? He looks like it. You're getting to know these intrepid adventurers then. Alex and his little brother Brad trying to swim with the big fish. Both seem out of their depth. And Julia, the love of Alex's life. And he, the love of hers. What about Conrad? A bold fellow, you might say. Or maybe you'd say arrogant. Absolutely. And then there's Captain Also Fitz, asshole. That would, you strong, know. Forthright, stubborn. She appears somewhat immune to Conrad's charms, so far at least. So d would everybody, I would assume. Assure you, you help them to make some decisions they'll value later on. Oh, all right. You're doing well. Hey, curator daddy is pleased. Let's go. So, we're like 10 seconds out of the jaws of certain death. Well, certain, I mean, that's relative. And this meatball... Meatball? This meatball pulls a ring out of God knows where. <laughs> yeah, where did you hide the ring? A lady never tells. Well, needless to say, this His lady ass. is impressed. Uh, well played there, man, no? It wasn't Conrad... But the aim was not to do... Well. Okay. <laughs> Maybe he decided, hey, I'll drink some, and then he got drunk. <laughs> and since he was drunk, he forgot to bring it to us. And he just kept on drinking, and he drank all of it. Uh, Thank you, Bert. Like you've had some experience with this kind of phenomenon. Yeah, I've been studying it for years. I'll go look for him. Oh, we found a bullet lodged in the plane. Huh. I left it below deck if you want to check it out. Below which deck? So, how does it feel to soon be known as the Mr. Julia Smith? <laughs> yeah, can I say with my own name? You know, the one that's not, like, generic is all hell. Yeah, I don't know. I'm kind of building a career with my own name. I was kind of thinking I'd just stick with that. Well, sure. You could always have a professional name, like a stage name, and then your real name. Oh, boy. You're not having second thoughts, are you? No, I just want to keep my name, you fucking weirdo. No, of course not. A, a lot of women keep their own name now. And don't forget, it's the bride's family that usually foots the bill, so I've just been thinking about the best way to pitch it to my dad. Great. What? 
If your dad pulls out all the stops and we have the wedding of a century, people are gonna think I married you for your money. No, oh, I was hoping they'd think you married me for my hot bot. Julia. But I'd rather them think I married you because I want you to be my property. If you don't take my last name, then how are they gonna know? Fuck off, Alex. Hey, what do you think's not a big deal? Really, I'm sorry that's on your mind. The second you said yes, I could see our whole future rolling out ahead of us. So you can walk all over me? <laughs> Get him. Like a rug so you can walk all over me? Where did everyone go? There was much celebration to be had. They I'll walked away from this weird ass left. conversation. Hey, you seen my brother? Or Fliss? Uh, no, I uh, got distracted. Let's go get him. Sure. So, which one is, uh, you know, where the magic happens? It's actually outside in the ocean at the bottom. Why don't you go down and find out? What's your problem? Give it a rest already. Okay, that's enough of that. Conrad, beers, where are they? Oh, yeah, the beers. I was just getting them now. All right. Now that everybody's here, let's take a look at the navigator's pad we found. Maybe we can figure out why the plane was out here. Where'd you put it? It's in your case. Okay, I'll go get it. Hey. Yep. All right. Let's see what other pictures he took. Or not. All right. Cool. Dude, nice camera. Okay. No, we actually are. Uh-huh. Air Rescue Service, Conwyn Island. Never thought you were the settling type. A lot of uncomfy hard cuts in this. Yeah, it's not cut super great. Wait, what do you mean? You told me to follow my heart. One, I'm not that sappy. And two, I was talking about med school. Still. They uh they definitely were trying to fill themselves when making this game. Because the first one that they had was Until Dawn. And I don't think they made any games before that. And Until Dawn was a uh, bigger undertaking than this. I think all the Dark Pictures stuff was made by a uh, side team inside the studio, I want to say. I don't think this was an oh, entire team effort. I guess I just took too long. I was looking around. Come here, you vixen. You. Easy, tiger. We should get back. Right here. The other scariest thing of all, heteros. <laughs> You'll get no resistance there. All right, everyone. Check it out. Manchurian gold. Who wants to find some No, it's candidate. Treasure? So what that's, do you think, Captain? That's the movie. Coordinates? Those are coordinates, all right. Maybe the plane's destination? You think we could get there by tomorrow? It takes a couple hours if the weather stays steady. Wow. Because that's she funny. just knows where <laughs> those coordinates are off the top of her head. Plane. Yeah, that makes sense. After the war, they turned long-range bombers into rescue planes. And then this plane must have been shot down because it was riddled with bullet holes. I found one lodged in the fuselage, huh. and it was full of life rafts. Must have gotten shot down before they could deliver all the rafts. There was only one missing. Reckless, all of you. Excuse me? I told you to leave everything down there alone. Oh, come on. We've been through this already. I'm not talking about the law. No, hey, they were respectful. No, you did whatever you wanted. Whatever you took, it was too much. Nobody knows. Okay, maybe. Yeah, okay, all right. You're right. We should have been more careful. That's not me, I'm sorry. Whatever okay. calms her down. Maybe. I don't know you. You should have never gone down to that plane in the first place. It's bad luck. 
You think you can scavenge down there and it makes no difference, but every single thing you bring back has an essence. It's like a ghost you invite to the surface. Here we go. Huh. I never thought about it like that. You never think about much of anything. Well, maybe I never heard about such cool ghost stories. They're not cool ghost stories. Not like for fun. People drown in these waters and you have to respect their resting place. Damn straight. Fred, you got a fun ghost story, right? Y yeah, I heard a story. Uh, happened right around here, too. Let's hear it. We could all use a good show. Let's hear it. I don't want to know. No, dude, give me the ghost story. Let's hear it. I'm here to be I bet scared. You a good yarn. It's kind of messed up, actually. Scare away, little bro. Okay. Here goes. To get this in the freezer, true, Conrad. And it happened right near here, in an old lighthouse. Classic setup. Wait. William Defoe was in there jerking the off. It was real spooky. Ah, well, Ooh. Now by the dockside, I found an ancient old man, skin like a leather book, eye patch, wooden leg, the whole nine yards, and for a dollar, he told me his secrets. Seems legit. The lighthouse stood atop an atoll, isolated from the rest of the world, a lone beacon in the night, a sailor's respite. The lighthouse keeper would hear the waves pounding the rocky shore. One misty morning, he comes upon a woman covered in blood. She's stumbling down the beach. He hurries to her aid and she falls into his arms, sobbing. As he hurries her back to the lighthouse, he asks where she's from. He doesn't waste any time. Smooth. Oh, shut up. <laughs> yes, please, shut up. Stop talking. The woman answers, I live here in the lighthouse. My parents are upstairs right now. Twist. <laughs> of course, the lighthouse keeper says, that isn't so. Of course, he's lived there alone for years. And the woman becomes hysterical and his sister parents are upstairs. So they go to the top of the lighthouse and there, splayed out on the floor, is a man and a woman brutally murdered with an axe. Oh shit, what dude. An axe? I mean, do people even use axes anymore? I'm just yes. The facts, cliches and all. All the time. Chopped up into what little do you mean? tiny giblets with an axe. You should embellish the facts. Gross. You know, sometimes you have to embellish the facts a little to get at the deeper truth. It's okay. Okay, so who did it? So the woman, uh, she's still hysterical, says her husband did it. And he's still here in the closet. Ha, <laughs> the husband, eh? <laughs> so is this a warning to all future brides? Hey, no backseats. You're locked in. So the lighthouse keeper <laughs> You're mine now, the female. Opens the door. I've claimed and you. Sure enough, there's a man inside. But he's cut his own throat. Horrified. He looks so he can breathe better. Dead man's face in the dark. Closer. Closer. And he sees. It's his own face. And then its eyes bulge out and screams. <laughs> Oh, oh, that was actually pretty cool. Twist. Nice. <laughs> nice one, Squire. Cool story. It wasn't scary. I mean, personally, but you know. You have me going. It's pretty cool. Heavy on the cheese there, corn dog. Heavy. Okay. Heavy on the cheese there, corn dog. Alex. Buddy. Can we, can we have a talk? Sit, sit down. Sit down for me. Have a seat. <laughs> we got, okay. All right. You've all had your fun. We should all turn in. There's some weather hitting our way. Uh-uh. No, no, no. No, because according to standard vessel regulation, we're all required one more beer before hitting the hay. What regulations are these? <laughs> uh, it's standard issue regulatory institutional protocol subdivision 1099. Uh-huh. <laughs> I'm surprised he didn't say 69, you found actually. A that tells you to drink beer under every circumstance. I'm just following orders, man. <laughs> I'm into this website. <laughs> and for good, buddy. <laughs> beer. Man things. Steak. Camping. Football. Let's go. <laughs> Drinking your own piss. Surviving in the wilderness. Um.
Mom, I throwed up. <laughs> oh shit, oh god, no, I took my, okay. Well, <laughs> I took my hand off the controller. He got, he got donkey punched. Whoops. I was going for a drink of water. I forgot you can't do that. I don't, I know font. I've made the mistake. I still don't think it would have mattered. Uh, it's One-Eyed Jack. He's back for the $30 you dropped in the ocean. Ungag, ungag. Uh, this one. Keep your mouth shut. You just had to piss them off, didn't you? How was I supposed to know? I'm sorry. Yeah, I don't think he is not the type of person that would say I'm sorry. How was I supposed to know they have no sense of humor? Yeah, let's just leave uh, Alex's duct tape on. He doesn't need to speak anymore. Oh, hey, man. Almost free. Maybe don't announce that. Piece of shit. I hate him. What are they gonna do to us? I don't even want to know. I want to get out of here. I'm in a lot of danger. Investigate, untie. Uh, d d investigate. <sighs> See if one of them's coming or not. for him out here, little lady. You're all alone with us now. Let's make the most of it. You can go fuck yourself, you piece of shit. You're the little lady. Why was half of the cast actually at the bottom of the ocean for the recording sessions and the other half was actually in the room? Like <laughs> Nice. One more time. You know how to treat a lady. What do you want? <laughs> that sounds like him. Oh, yeah. You know how to treat a lady, right? <laughs> Anything I can do to get this man hit more. <laughs> Down. 
Easy. Man, fuck you! Fuck you! I'm gonna kill you! Ah! Ooh! Ooh, actually took a chunk of his ear. Oh, God. Uh-oh. Generous. <laughs> Just a tiny little bit. I mean, that would still be really horrifically painful. D d yeah, uh, okay. 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 Maybe he learned his lesson after getting his ear sliced off. Where's Brad in all of this? I'm guessing that might be the scene. We saw him in the bathroom. I feel like they would have found him, though. All right, you should see the other guy. The other guy is me. Oh God! Let her know. You bastard! Hey, dipstick. Shut the fuck up. Dude, he whipped out the dipstick. Oh no! I don't know if he's gonna emotionally recover from that. Well, she's probably trying to keep you all from, you know, being stabbed. Did you see my brother? I'm sure he's fine. No, I hope he's okay. No, I didn't. I hope he's alright. Alright. Turn around. Don't let them see your hands. Once we get Julia back. Maybe we could take them by surprise. Okay, they're coming. The curator was in there. You see him? He's back there. He's in the, uh... Or is he called the collector in this? I don't know what his title is. I'm calling him the curator, though. What? How much money they have. What is it? I took my ring. <sighs> Julia, it's okay. It's okay. But how will anybody know that you're my property now? Fuck, dude. <sighs> Curator, but I didn't see him. Yeah, he was in the background. Now we just have to wait and see what they want to do with us. I hope it's some kind of party. Thunder counting. Seven, eight. Yep. Eight seconds. The storm's eight miles away. We came here on a boat. Maybe we can take it. Yeah. Yeah, it's a speedboat. The main guy. Oh, his face is all We've swollen now. If we play our cards right, we can catch him by surprise. Take him out. Oh, hey, Alex. How you doing, bud? Look, maybe I can fix him. You think? You think I can fix Alex? Uh, I can sneak around to the boat. If you can distract them, I can sneak around to the speedboat. The dude with the gun won't even realize until I'm long gone. Seven seconds. I can get out through the window. Gotta break these off first. Too loud. They'll hear it. But we're gonna break them during the thunder. <sighs> Good call. I'll go through the window and get the boat. You guys distract them. Conrad, just stay focused and get to the, boat. the title. No. Okay. <laughs> Oh dear. Hey. Oh shit, dude. What do you mean? How'd this man hear my heart? <laughs> oh well. Uh oh. You're pretty stupid. 
Oops. Hey, but he was used as a good distraction. What are you doing, you idiot? Think about what you're doing, boy. Think about what you're doing, dude. Get out. Go. This kid's trying to kill me also. Um, uh, uh, but take the gun. <laughs> it got him hit again. <laughs> Let's go. No! Alex, this is crazy. Get off our boat. Ha! Your boat? I'm the captain now. Oh, he did the thing! Get these assholes out of here. Get on your boat. Now. See what you did? Dude. Is she actually dead? Take this. Use it if you have to. Hey, that's one down. Sit down. Did she get shot in the head? I didn't see. Over there. You, right here. Sit. Now. Arrêtez, bande de con. C'est mon bateau. Stop. Ferme là, ou je te mets mon poing dans la gueule. This is going well. This is exactly how I planned it. Olsen! Come here! I told you I was gonna pick them all off. <laughs> One of you is gonna tell me about this Manchurian go. Well, first of all, it's a candidate. No, I'm not gonna stop making that joke. Oh, see, she's fine. I'm here. She's not dead. It's okay. She just got grazed. This man has poor trigger discipline. How could we have been so stupid? We're lucky it's not worse. We could have been killed. What were you thinking? This isn't just about you, Julia. We could have turned it around and we wouldn't be in this mess right now. All right. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> oh, give me a break with that gangster shit. I don't think you fully comprehend the severity of your situation, sister. Hey, come on. We're just passing time. No big deal. Keep quiet. Captain says shut your mouth. You shut your mouth. Sit still, all of you. The boat was rocking, you dick. You, come with me. Find out how long the storm is gonna last. Will you try anything? Anything fishy? And they'll be crazy. <laughs> Get it? Fishy? Because we're in the ocean? Dude. Taxes? No? Duke of Milan requesting weather update. Over. Yeah, we read you. Everything okay? Over. Hey, uh, just.
just requesting any information about this storm you can give us. It's a little bit hairy out here. Over. Big storm coming in from the east. Gonna hit you pretty hard, but should pass through your coordinates within an hour. You sound a little stressed, Duke. Please let me know if you need assistance. Not used to a little weather freaking you out. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. A okay out here. We can handle a couple of puffs and drops of rain. Yeah, no, we're uh, great. Thanks for the info. Everything's we'll fine. For drinks back on shore in a couple of days. No, oh God. No, oh God. Okay, I wasn't expecting to. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right. Is he dead? <laughs> like, Brad? where'd he go? Anyone know about Brad? Is he hiding somewhere? I don't know where he is. Okay, keep a lid on it. It could be our ticket out. Brad stays hidden. Better off down there than with these psychos. Yep, there you oh, go. Oh yeah, great. He could get killed down there. He's having a lion. Also, yeah, let, maybe let's not talk openly about Brad. Oh, shit. It's the ghost ship. And then they all died. The end. Everyone's still alive. Oh. Things could have been quite different. I guess I was wrong. <sighs> Kind-hearted creature I am, I'd like to offer you some forewarning of what's to come. Tempted? I mean, sure. <laughs> okay, then. We will turn to the Bard for inspiration. The Merchant of Venice, Act 2, Scene 7. The Prince of Morocco pulls a scroll from the eye of a skull and reads, All that glisters is not gold. Often have you heard that told. Anyway, now that you've reached a point what? of significant distress, I presume you're eager to get back to your story. Not really. But here's a thing. Everything may not be entirely as it seems. Is it getting a little drinky? <sighs> Probably shouldn't have said that. All right, you coy bastard. God, Red. If it weren't for his eyes, I'd hate him. <laughs> Junior. 
curator's alcohol habit is now out of control. Uh, yeah, and in my control now. Oh no, she, he took the fucking, uh, revolver chamber. I feel like one of them could have just kicked him off when he jumped over. Jesus. Are they all barefoot? Uh, nope. No thanks. Are they all barefoot on this boat right now? That is a surefire way to get tetanus. Go on, keep moving. They are barefoot. Except for Alex, he's the only one with shoes on. Sneeze. <laughs> <laughs> right. Wait, hold on. There might be stuff, though. Uh, Alex? No, uh, Captain. Why'd you just do like an interpretive dance, dude? Did you guys see his leg? He did a kicky. <laughs> what was that about? You are right? Uh huh. Making fun of them speaking French? No, I actually had to sneeze. <laughs> this whole place is a floating gun. Yeah, all right. Well, I guess we're not going that way. You guys took a ring, now her bracelet? Fuck you. These guys suck. I'm starting to, sus to suspect they may not be good people. I did not sign up for a trip to Creek Town. The Mask of Madness. Do you dare to look death in the eye? Now showing in the mess hall. Oh, I want the poster. Alright, fine. Oh, am I still? Oh, okay. The game's like too cinematic. I can't tell. I can't tell. Got anything in here? I'm not reading their dialogue if I need to. Miller. Tim Miller. Fuck you, dude. I'm looking. Can can I see? Is there anything? No. Okay. Oh shit! Oh, a rat. Oh shit! It's a rat. Ooh, what's the thing? Internal memorandum. To Private O'Neill, you're covering Patterson's guard duties tomorrow. Uh, he... Wait, hold on. He is sick again. Conveniently, it's always when he has guard duties in hold 3A. First is 2400. Check chart rotation. William P. Ford. Happy to QM. Ams. <laughs> Rats on the boat. Zero out of five stars. <laughs> oh shit, it's a rat. 
Dude, I can't believe these people are walking around here barefoot. That's like, that's more upsetting to me than anything else. Thank you. All right. Appreciate it. What the hell is this fucking place? Uh, it's a boat. Meathead seems spooked. So, what's the standard nautical protocol for being kidnapped and imprisoned on an abandoned hell ship? <laughs> <laughs> I'll let you know when I find out. Yeah, is that one written in your law book, Missy? You can't just sit around. You need a plan. We're not exactly in the best position to be making any moves. The second they let their guard down, we gotta take advantage of it and get off the ship. It's dangerous here. I'm hurt too bad. Uh, yeah, that one. Yeah, man. This whole rust bucket's one tetanus shot from the bottom of the ocean. We already tried to escape. Didn't exactly work out. Yeah, but now we you're like back to the boat on a big crash. ship, so. What happened to him? No idea. They swiped our distributor cap. It's gonna be difficult to get anywhere without it. Oh, that's what that was. Okay. Uh, hot hot wire? So can't we just like hot wire or something? You cannot ought wire distributor cap. Well, how do you know? Have you tried? I knew exactly what they were doing. While well, those guys are out panning for Manchurian gold Candidate. or whatever they think they're going to find on this floating coffin, we got to take advantage and look around for a way out of here. Truthful. Okay. Sure. I don't know what about that dialogue option said truthful, but why not? Hmm. This won't make any noise. Oh, I really didn't. Never mind. Okay. I was proven a liar. Hey. Look what I found over I there. immediately found the way out. <laughs> well, I hope there wasn't anything in this room I needed. Oh no, I can explore still. Okay, good. Ooh, newspaper. What happened here? La, uh, American Overseas Gangland Ling of 1944. K killing. Or 1947, excuse me. Archaeologists missing in Iraq. 24 British archaeologists have gone missing in the Zagros Mountains of Iraq. The Hodgson exp Expedition arrived in the kingdom in September last year with the stated goal of unearthing the... Relics... Hold on, I can kind of read it. Hold on. Relics of Iraq's ancient past. Ha! Hold on. Wait, I can read it. Hold on. Wait. Hodgson, the archaeologists were due to return to Baghdad in the spring, but ceased sending regular radio reports in December. After conducting many searches of the region, local authorities criticized the secrecy surrounding the expedition, which has made pinpointing is uh, its whereabouts difficult. Uh, London's Royal Historical Society rebuffed such claims, uh, citing armed rebels opposed to the British occupation as the more likely culprits behind the expedition's disappearance. Continued on page seven. Everyone loves young cream soda. Well. I like cream soda. Ugh. That hurt my back. I didn't actually read it upside down. I like contorted myself to try to read it. <laughs> 
Ooh, spectacles? Real, real creepy. What, they're just glasses, dude. Why are you creeped out by glasses? What do you mean? Not used to people, like, augmenting their bodies in order to see? Conrad is ableist. <laughs> Miss J. Rivera? 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 Yeah. Apartment 2, 275 Lockwood Drive. I don't need to know their fucking address. Hi, baby doll. I'm really scared. I miss you like crazy. Three months until my next leave and jumping into your arms. Three months. It's been on some shore leave with the guys. Had a few beers, but don't worry. I'm keeping everything ready for you if you catch my drift. Dude, hot and ready. <laughs> Let's go. Uh, how's work? I hope that boss of yours is leaving you alone. I know you can take care of yourself, but I feel helpless being so far away, and I want to keep you safe. Great. Of all the places I'm gonna die on. I really hate that flash that it does shit. every time I get a secret. I get a lot of time to think while I'm guarding the cargo holds. It's dark and spooky down there. Some of the other guys have seen a roaming fi uh, figure roaming around, but I've always got you with me to keep me safe too. I will be with you soon and get a job as a mechanic and we can get married and have two children, specifically two, okay? We'll be happy together forever. Love you so much, Miller X. I don't think Miller made it. I wonder why this was ripped off. Hmm. I don't know. <gasps> Doggy! Ship mascot! Aw, puppy! Hey, buddy. <laughs> Ew, they're breeders. Gross. Only two. If we have a third one, I'm getting a divorce immediately. <laughs> we'll have to find it a new home. I'm not taking care of it. Any luck? I can't get it open. Well, it would probably help if you used your hands. You haven't even touched it. <laughs> you know, just a thought. Maybe we can bend it open and get out of here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We don't know where a bed like this would go. Well, I mean, you know, anywhere other than this fucking room. What's wrong with you? Wherever it leads, it can't be worse than here. You want me to just smash through this wall? Oh yeah, sure. Alex yeah, Smash. Like Someone should create a distraction. Dude, he could knock it out with his big on. ass. Yeah, okay. Conrad. All he's got to do is turn around and that wall would be down instantly. Uh, barricade the door. Push. Oh, am I pushing? What's happening here? Come on now. Oh, smash it. Smash it. There we go. It's fine. We got it. Does that door open inwards or outwards? Okay, it opens this way. <laughs> I was going to say, if it opens the other way, don't think it would have mattered. <laughs> uh, to fucking hide, dude. Go. I thought she would come with. Why did you just sit there? You could have left. Well, all right. <laughs> Are we safe now? Be quiet. We need to keep going. No, fuck that. We have to go back for Fliss. I'm the reason she got snagged. No way. No heroics. We gotta get as far away from here as we can. Shit. You're right. Is he, though? But what's in here, though? Fuck. 
All ship personnel, extra guard duty regulations, <laughs> duty. Uh, due to the special security precautions on this mission, additional procedures must be adopted by soldiers on guard duty. <laughs> Double guard duty <laughs> on all doors and all watches. No talking, no playing of games, no smoking, no alcohol, no gambling. Guard personnel found breaking any of these regulations will be met with the sternest of punishments up to and including court-martial. By order of Captain Ford. Guys, nobody is allowed into 3A. Seriously, nobody. Especially those on duty. Yeah. It's a bird. Oh, no. <laughs> Also, yes, probably. Ooh. Oh, maybe I can find some boots in here for my guy. Oh, there's some shoes. Let's get some shoes. And then there's the mystery of the smelling socks, pungent briefs. Yeah, we found it. Perfect. Plop your head in there and take a big sniff. Oh, sh okay. <laughs> All right, actually got me. Oh, there wasn't actually anything in it. Boo! Jump scare rat. Angie. Uh, ma'am? Uh, hello? Ghost nurse? She was over there in the corner. That was creepy. I just want to know where the hell they all went. There should have been dozens of people on board. Hundreds. How could they all just vanish and leave all of their stuff behind? Something doesn't add up. Uh, usually to get less people, you subtract, so... Just saying. Where's the you are here arrow? All right. Oops. Division involved? Oh no. No, that's too complicated a math. What, dude? I didn't do it. Let me in. Let me in. Uh oh. Ah, uh, toilet notes. Eileen Reed from Oklahoma. Dear, I, 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 I eels, I, I, Isles, eels. The fuck is his name? What do you mean? I'm finally coming home. This is it, darling. One last trip across the Pacific and I'll be back to you and the girls. I can't wait to see your faces. Tell Ned and Nancy to get excited. They they gonna see daddy real soon and he's got gifts for y'all. I'm sure glad to be back at sea. It's hotter than an Oklahoma summer out here on land and there's no escape from it. I've been all right because I got your letters keep me going. They censored them, which is probably for the best, because sometimes the others steal them to read, and I don't like them reading our letters. I know. Really creeps me out. He keeps telling me there's a little boy on board, and it keeps, and it sounds like Ted. I know he's just messing with me. There ain't no way we got a stowaway. Our ops guy, our guys are far too slick now the war is over. I bet they'll edit this bit out. But it shows what a place can do to a guy. I gotta go for now, honey. There's some commotion outside. That usually means I'm about to be real busy for a while. I'll write again soon, Robert XX. Spooky. All right. 
some lemonade and it went down the wrong tube. Uh-oh. Can I come over and put it in the right tube? Just ask it. <sighs> Thing over here? No? Cool. Neat. Guess I'll leave. God, I wonder if Fliss is okay. Eh, she's fine. What are they doing to her? Jay, you're gonna drive yourself crazy. Just hope for the best. Okay. You hear that? If by that you mean the terrifying sound, then no, I didn't hear anything. You know you did? Was it something moving? Something moving would make that sound, sure. Yeah, it's almost like this is a rotting ship on the ocean. Shit's gonna be moving, yo. Hello. What did that say? Did it say dotty 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 dotty? <laughs> Listen, ghost. Dude, sick book. Oh, all right. June 19th, I identified prob uh, I identified problem areas with structural brittleness and cracks in some sections of cargo hold one. I instructed our shipwright to carry out the necessary welding repairs. I advised the captain to go easy, especially in bad weather. Any aggressive movement could cause the ship to break its back. Uh, June 20th, I responded to a complaint that some electronic equipment had been malfunctioning recently. I discovered gross of tin whiskers around some of the components. I discovered gross of tin whiskers around... What does that mean? I claimed and added lead to the soldiers... So solders. It just stopped the equipment shorting out and should slow down the growth. What? Oh, I didn't read the other... Hold on. Maybe there's more. No, wait. Go back. I didn't turn the page. Lines of tin that look like... I guess so. Can I turn the page? Oh, I can. There we go. <laughs> June. Log. We totally fucked. What? <laughs> I conducted a thorough weekly engine room inspection of fuel, oil, and fluid, which showed lower levels of cylinder oil than expected. I have rem reminded staff in the engine room to be attentive and vigilant with their hourly checks to alert an engineer. If there is any loss of pressure. June 22nd. The ship was caught in a heavy electrical storm, which began shortly after midnight. The lightning strikes caused a lot of electrical arcing, traveling through hoisting cables, a loft deck, which has left damage. The grease has boiled up and destroyed some of the cabling. I've received reports that the main problems caused by the storm are with electrical equipment at the moment. It's likely the tin whiskers haven't helped matters. Despite the rough sea, there have been no reports of any structural damage. However, I'll have to work through the night to make a full damage assessment. Oh, title, did you get? Metal whiskering is a phenomenon, do 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 which occurs in electrical devices when metals from long whisker-like projections over time. Tin whiskers were noticed and documented in the vacuum tube era of electronics early in the 20th century uh, in equipment that used pure or almost pure tin solder in their production. It was noticed that small metal hairs or tendrils grew between metal solder pads, causing short circuits. Oh. Huh. Interesting. Fuck it. Who cares? I didn't try to turn the page again. I just can't believe this is happening. I care. I'm invested. All right, I'll go back to the book. You think he's still on the Duke? You, you think he's taking a Duke? Okay, yeah. Oh, wait, we read all of it. We're good. All right. Let me out.
Mm -mm -mm -mm. Anything over here? Nope. Oh, this is nice. Maybe oh, turn around. In the hole for a big surprise party. Oh, there's a thing. Okay, there we go. Oh, it's a, like a rat skull. Dude, snack on it. Just pop them in your mouth. Whiskering of some metal may puzzle link. Yeah, you should be able to. I don't I don't think we yeah, we don't have a permit thing, but I think you're exempt. Yeah, there you go. You're good. I want to see what this looks like. Oh, 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 the metal just becomes fuzzy. Oh, it grows hair. Ew. Oh, I hate that. That's awful. Yeah, no, that's cursed. That's that's pretty cursed. Don't don't like that at all. Didn't know that was a thing that could happen. Just pure metal. That's so weird. Huh. Thursday 12. All right. The skipper has KO'd the booze for this whole goddamn trip. There's nothing like being sober to make you realize just how quiet the ship is. There was a fight between those dumb schmucks, Wilson and Anderson, right before we or right after we sailed. But Ferris nipped that in the bud real quick. And it's been quiet in as a church ever since. Uh, I got talking with a feller who had helped load up the ship. He told me they put a bunch of coffins on board, which isn't uh, so weird, maybe. But he said there was some guy who made sure the coffins were all put in one of the holds just right. Real precise, not the treatment you'd get. Uh, if you were any old grunt, it's got me thinking who could it be in those boxes. Friday the 13th, Jason? Booze was a bum loss. Perez said he felt drunk after four cups. But I said he was talking baloney. It's not. It's not how you spell it. It's B-O-L-O-G-N-A. Because my baloney has a first name. You bitch. It was like ditch water. Perez said they made some hooch from some supplies they lifted. Meeting up later down on six. To check it out. Saturday 14 just heard one of the guys here snuck a look at those boxes. I'm gonna find him and see what he saw. Maybe he can even help me get uh get in to take a look. It's all set, he reckons he can sneak me in. We're gonna take a look tonight. Probably not a great idea. Just throwing it out there. Sunday 15. It's all off. The guy who was gonna help me. Uh, get in the hold has been signed off sick. Doc Finley thinks he's some kind of flake, which might be true, but Miller says it's something else. Something weird about that place. Miller's kind of a twitcher. Dude, he streams? What's his, what's his handle? Uh, wouldn't want to be caught in a pinch with him, that's for sure. Tuesday, 17, Perez said that the boys made more hooch. Too bummed out to sneak and try some, but what else is there to do? News, new batch is worse than the last one. Never listening to any damn fool idea from Perez ever again. Saturday, 21st. Last night, I was on duty. Observation duty? With Wallovics. Wallovix. Sure. And god damn, if he didn't creep me out. He spooked and startled, started babbling about some sergeant called Jones that went MIA in the jungle. Reckon that Jones and his crew were the ones in the boxes traveling home like us saps. I sneaked a look and Jesus, there it was. It was like the guy in the port had said. All laid out real nice, all old glory over each one. If it's Jones in there, they've done him proud. Good old Uncle Sam wouldn't leave any of us out there. He'd make sure we all come. Would you like to finish that sentence? No? <laughs> Uncle Sam's gonna make sure we all come, dude. Personally, he's gonna see to it himself. 
All right. I mean, I'm I'm down. I guess. Who would have guessed? Oh, let's see what else is in the nasty bunk area. Dude, this place sucks. Oh, hey, a picture. Ooh. Alex getting his head... How is this helpful at all? Did you not say the person moving? I, I thought I thought that was Alex. Was it not? Or Julia? Because we have other people in the room, so I, I just assumed it was one of them. Yeah, these premonitions are not helpful at all. Like, at least the ones in the quarry were helpful. I thought it was a ghost. Yeah, I mean it could have been. But yeah, Julia's in here, and I'm pretty sure Alex is here too, so. I think he went out the door. Uh, what's towards the camera? Nothing? Cool. Yeah, there he is. Yeah, maybe don't lean on that railing. Probably not a great idea. Also, turn the flashlight off. Like, dude. <gasps> Hi, Tube! Hey, buddy. How's it going? Welcome in. I fit into both of those categories. I feel special. I don't know, flaunt, scratch it. This man got the sledge. Why would he just set that down? Think it's safe to grab it? Can't go for it. We gotta be getting no, be careful. We gotta be careful. Could be a trap. Oh shit. Yeah, Bless you. Yeah. Get As an aside, get fuck it. Twitch, dude. Fuck Twitch. Yeah, man. Not worth it. What happened? You didn't hear nothing, dude. Arrête de crier, j'essaie d'entendre ce qui se passe. Je crie pas. Ta gueule. Got into the stream, Je went to unmute, accidentally hit pause, then unpaused, and guess what? The ad. Oh, really? Gross. We're gonna follow them. Twitch has gotten so egregious with their ads, it's disgusting. Because you know this website just needs more money. I got this. Oh, I'm double caked up on a Saturday night, man. I could think of worse superheroes. New York? What? Okay. Uh. Yeah, 
internal memo to all crew area 7c has been converted to a temporary chapel of rest for the dura uh, of rest for the duration of the voyage all crew are required to be silent and respectful when passing near section 7c corporal moore Ch chaplain okay. you're not subbed it desyncs the audio from the video and it's terrible what? No, that's gross. That causes the ad to play. <laughs> that's fucking awful. You're playing my favorite game? Resident Evil 4? <laughs> Metroid Prime, I'm guessing. Cookie Clicker? Okay. I legit have Cookie Clicker, and I do play it every now and again. <laughs> Not my favorite game, but, you know. Metroid Prime? Dude, let's go. Best game all time. Top five. Gotta say. <laughs> it really wasn't that bad. It was just frustrating for me. Can I not go this way? Okay. Can't go that way. I can't move the flashlight around. Ooh. Well, that looks like a thing. That barrel's in the way, though, I guess. Barrel! The door? Oh, no. It's just the wall. Never mind. Is this a way? What's this? I go down here. Big ice monster killed you. Oh no. I'm sorry. Why is this place like roaring? What monster is on this ship? Hello? No, we haven't. I don't think so. Oh, I swear we've been here before, Alex. Have you been leading us in circles? What? Come on, guys. We gotta keep moving. The fucking kitchen, dude. We have never been here. What do you mean? I would have remembered. This is where the food is. Uh, yes. Take this. I mean. Hey, easy with that. We shouldn't be screwing around right now. Nice blade. Could make a nice severance package for my assailants if you catch my drift. <laughs> okay. Yeah, keep it. Like, what are you talking about? I guess you never know. We might have to use it. So I'm going to put it right well, up my butt. I don't want to end up hurting the wrong person with that. You should just put it down. What do you mean? What? Ma'am, what situation do you think we're in here? Like, <laughs> every single person should have a weapon. Are you kidding? No wonder you got shot in the head. I don't feel bad about that anymore. Oh, dude. Some SpaghettiOs? Jour, mademoiselle? As if you know your way around the kitchen. Please, relax. Just messing around. Getting some 999 vibes from this. I don't know what that means. We're so hetero, I hate it. <laughs> hey! According to this, Ooh. today's beef casserole. Mm, yummy. Let's go. It's as if everything just ground to a halt on this one day. The whole ship just stopped functioning. Hmm. They didn't even get their beef casserole, dude. Ripperoni. Breakfast boiled eggs. Lunch broiled halibut with potatoes and fresh lima beans. Home fried potatoes. Spelled wrong. Roast beef with fresh vegetables. And navy baked beans with salt pork. Cold roast beef with salad and spiced beets. 
Fresh? Yeah, you can have you can have you can store fresh produce. It's not gonna last terribly long, but you can keep it for quite a while. <clears throat> Whipped whipped beef on cornbread. What is whipped beef on cornbread? Do they just take a steak and smack the shit out of it? What, <laughs> what do you mean? What what is that? It's creamed whipped beef? That doesn't make any more sense. What hello? Roast lamb with new potatoes and carrots. As opposed to old potatoes? I'm so confused by this entire list. Hello? We've got crisp bacon. Scrambled eggs. And beef casserole. Okay. Grilled bacon and hash brown potatoes. That sounds great. Braised liver and buttered fresh peas. And then Tuesday, you just get cereal and green split pea soup. <laughs> really hope you're not hungry on Tuesday. You're kind of out of luck on that one. <laughs> you might be having a bad day on Tuesday. Just saying. Yeah, they ate the entire stock for the rest of the week. And then on Tuesday, you just get cereal and peas. Also, why did their week start on, like, Wednesday? Uh, Alright. Alright, what is this place? I'm thinking we gotta go through here. Uh, this looks like a mess hall. But what's this, though? Yeah, don't I have, like, a hustle button? Oh, cool, another unhelpful painting. Okay, Brad got stabbed. By somebody. Countering caskets. Alright, well, let's try not to stab Brad. I guess it's because I picked up the knife. Look, as long as Brad doesn't go sifting around in my shorts, he won't find the knife. And I won't stab him, so. This isn't right. What? What? There's something in here with us. Did, didn't you? I mean, did you hear anything? No. Sure didn't. All right, well, we should keep moving. Where is Brad? How did they miss him on the boat? That's probably just rats, dude. Rats. Probably just rats. 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 We are rats. Don't fucking laugh at me. I didn't laugh. What? All right. <laughs> Guys, I think we might be getting a divorce. What do you want to do? Turn around? We've seen all this before. Cool, Jay. We don't have a lot The entire of ship looks the same. What do you mean? Because she has a head wound? No. Okay. No. This isn't working for me. What? Uh-oh. Gross caskets and crappy chapels. Not my scene, you know? Dude. New band name. Gross ca caskets and crappy chapels. Uh, You're right. Yeah, dude, it's, it's gross, crappy. And it's crappy. You gotta get out of your toot sweet. And we gotta find Fliss. <laughs> he said okay, toot. So can we just <laughs> take out then? What is this? Hey, we got a name on this guy. And what are they even doing here? I don't think stuck on a ghost ship for all eternity sounds like a good plan, eh? Who cares where they're from or where they're going? They're dead and we're not, so let's keep it that way. All right, bitch. <laughs> Dude, Julia kind of sucks. 
Yeah, let's open it. That seems like a good idea. Dude, double the skulls? Double the fun? Look at this. It's insane. Is it even human? Double Peter I, action? Was it ever human? What's the deal with this place? That is some bad mojo, dude. Okay, leave. Now. Leave, leave, leave! <laughs> I think Julia might be losing it. Got some serious locks in these caskets. Why would they be chained and locked? Well, that's one way to end a relationship. What? 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 Conrad, what? What do you want about? Look at this one. Like for a kid or something. I don't want to know. Let's get out of here. Yes! Maybe that's little baby Dracula. Right there, and those are his parents, and they're lying in the dirt from their native country. And, and then they all jump on Conrad and eat off his face. <laughs> the end. Oh no, what a problem that would be. <laughs> okay, he's such a wiener. He's such a wiener. Why do they always have to put a wiener character in these games? Show me the money. Oh, hey, buddy. Oh! Oh! What is it? Look! What? Seriously? Are you trying to freak me out? Huh? Can we just get out of here? Oh, it was a vase. Oh, uh, it wasn't a head. So, no head? Kind of mad, actually? Because I killed. <laughs> Got him. Can we please hurry? I'm done fighting you. Roger that. We gotta get a place. No time to lose. <laughs> no time to lose. That's all we've been doing is killing time. What the hell is making that sound? There's a head and I nearly fell out of my chair, oh no. So spick and span. This is weirdly clean compared to the rest of the ship. There's also just a, you know, another two-headed body. Any medicine we find in here is gonna be Way out of date is what he was going to say. Aspirin. Nice. Still might have some kick. Four years of med school and prescribed me an 80-year-old aspirin to call me in the morning. That's... You shouldn't take that. Don't. That's not going to make him sick, is it? Probably. That would probably kill him. <laughs> okay, well... If he's uh, convulsing on the floor later on, we know why. Not that I'm going to complain, but... What? Look! Hey, this is no time to be fucking around. I'm serious. I can't take it. It's getting spooky. Oh, that's that guy. Yeah, let's touch him. Oh, why did he inflate? <laughs> Why did you touch it? Why did he become a balloon for half a second? What the hell? Hello? That was fun. All right. Can't go in there. They went that way. Oh, hey, man. Ooh. Maybe just get in some air. Oh, like this guy? Yeah, definitely didn't have a great time. Well, you know, probably worse ways to go than being sedated on a hospital gurney and then just, you know, kind of dying. Oh, hey. Oh, hey, Doc. Oh, I think Doc had, like, a worse time. Uh-oh. What the hell? Ooh, that's Looks really like creepy. Fright. You can't see that. Why'd you sound so casual about it? Yeah, that's I. That's actually really creepy. 
I could have sworn something here. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so this guy had appendicitis, which is pretty routine, and then, then he died of a massive heart attack, which is not routine at all. Hmm. Hashtag nope. I've seen that movie. It's great. Seven seven eighteen. He old. Old AF, as the kids would say. All right. Well, see you, dude. He didn't do anything creepy. I'm kind of disappointed. Connie? 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 Is that what we're calling him now? I'm in. Connie, where the fuck are you? Where is Conrad? She called him Con. Oh, did she? I didn't hear. I was probably Connie? talking over it. But, uh, quiet, dude. We're going to hear. Shh, quiet. I can shout if I want. Connie! It, if they find us, the hell did he go? I'm pushing you out in front. Also, apparently, my in game tinnitus is acting up. <gasps> Rat buddy. Hello. Okay, bye. Ratatouille? Why would I tell you? Flitz. Find a way to escape Danny. Find the others. All right. Tell me where we are going, damn it! Damn it! I did not hit her. It's a hook. I thought there was something crawling on the ceiling. No, it's a hook in the foreground. <laughs> Ooh, anything over here? Ooh. Don't look. Hey, back off. Leave that alone. All right, dude. Oh, well, maybe I can go get it at some point. <laughs> you don't even know what you're doing. You just do whatever he tells you, don't you? Yeah, where are we going, bro? Why am I the one leading the way? Stop. Okay, all right. Over here. Nope, can't go that way. All right, cool. Anything over here? Nope, okay. Want to enjoy my video games? Uh, dude, I know that feel. What time is it 9.30? I probably should be uh, stopping soon-ish. Once I get to a... Once I get to a place where it, it feels okay to stop... Losing it. I need a robot body, dude. Same. These fucking places cursed. This guy's an idiot. Well, I mean, there is a reason for all of this, and I know what it is. Oh, can we wear the hat? Oh, let me put the hat on. Come on, dude. Let's have some fun. NG Medan. The man? Did we find him? No? Come on. All right, fine. What was that noise? What are you talking about? 
I don't want to hear anything from you. Olsen! Oh. Dude, this game's just full of cheap jump scares, isn't it? That's what they got. I scare you again? I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm scarier than the game. Probably still right here with us. I mean, you die on a ship, your ghost stays on the ship. You die on the ship, you die in real life. You have no idea what you're talking about. Hey, sweet thing, want a kiss? Oh, maybe she does. Where did all your friends go? I don't know what the fuck this is all about, but we gotta keep moving and find Olsen. Now! Secret found. Terrified looking corpse. It looks as though they were cowering away from something when they died. So, everybody on the ship kind of died from fear Olsen? that we've come across so far. So that's fun. Oh, spooky hand! Ah, oh, shit, dude. What? Oh, dick. I guess I'm not getting a premonition from that one. All right. This guy's a wiener. Now's your chance. Knock him out. Okay. Well, all right. Do it. Get him. Maybe this guy shouldn't have the gun. Good question. Who knows? Maybe we'll find out next time. On Man of Medan. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, I think that's a, uh, you know, good place to end it, you think? Maybe we find out what's around the corner. Next time? There's no save. Want to look at the picture first? Oh, can I? That would have been back where he was, right? Oh yeah, I guess we can go do that. Cool, we got his flashlight, sick. Let's see. I'll do this real quick. Oh! Satan? Okay. We've got Satan. All right. I don't know. Satan's pretty cool. Okay. Well, I mean, I kind of actually want to keep going, <laughs> but <laughs> it's getting a little late. It's getting a little late. Oh, man. I think, uh, I think right there with our guy being... I don't know. He just ran off, started shooting, <laughs> shooting wildly. Well, uh, I guess we'll find out what happened to him on next time. Yeah. It's early, early morning. La Mayo. <laughs> oh, geez. All right. Well, hey, that was, uh, I'm actually having a pretty good time with this. It's not bad. I'm not. I'm not hating it so far. I know where it goes. I know how it ends for the most part. And I know what the mystery is, but I kind of like forgotten how we get there. So, but, you know, we'll discover it together. It'll be a good time. Anyway, uh, YouTube.
thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, I, I'm going to cut it right here, and we'll uh, we'll see you next time. Bye bye.